Okay, I have your brother's release paperwork here. Travel restrictions, community service. Once I sign this, I become his legal guardian. Hey, good to see you, brother. What's up? Nice place. It's got a guest bedroom for you down the hall. Who's this? My wife. We met at the firm after law school. I guess mom would be proud to know at least one of us made it home. I haven't slept in 12 years. You're only locked up for eight. Yeah. You don't like that he's here, do you? You've got that look all over your face. This here is your work release assignment, and you start immediately. The agency sent you over? Have you ever been in a studio before? Me? No. I signed up for the program because my father spent half his life in jail for tax evasion. When he got out, it was next to impossible for him to get a job. So I didn't think it was fair. Just remember, this is your brother's life, not yours. All you can do is try. That's the second time I've caught you watching. I didn't mean to watch. I've just never seen anything like that before. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's a lot to think about. OK, and cross it and back. <clears throat> you can't fix everyone. And I'm not trying to save anyone. Oh, the broken man that's paid to clean your toilets. We were just dancing. Look at this. What are you doing? I heard you got out. Thought I'd come see for myself since you never reached out. He called me a week before you got out, but I didn't tell him anything. He showed up at the dance studio today. There are things about me that you don't know. I don't want anything to happen to her or the studio. Doing something good doesn't wash off the bed, no matter how many times you try it.